You know it when you see it. Well, I think thus far, synthetic biology has been an application of engineering principles and frameworks to living systems. It is essentially the same thing. It's just using uh, things that come from living systems or materials that are related to living systems to build things that are designed by people to help people. Synthetic biology is designing DNA and building living things an approach to interacting with biology. It's an approach that appreciates that making, creating, and synthesizing is a powerful way to understand the living world and our role within it. Synthetic biology is getting to be good at matter, molecules. It's a technology of engineering cells to do things that are useful. It's a set of tools uh, for manipulating living organisms in ways that are more predictable and more reliable. Uh, I think right now it's more of a good idea than an actual field, um, but we are making slow but steady progress. So synthetic biology is a science and engineering field whose purpose is to make modifying genomes more predictable. So how do you uh, um, make, uh, engineer genomes so that they have uh, the function that you desire? So synthetic biology is an approach that uh, allows us to rebuild uh, biological systems and new biological functions that don't exist in nature and uh, we can use synthetic biology to uh, explore natural systems and get a better understanding of them or either build new functions that can help us solve big problems in the world.